All right, my name is Secret. You can find me at the release session no next yeah. Saturday. I'll be also at Hills and Hookers next Friday. Oh, hey. 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 I will be, you know. <laughs> y'all family, I know most of y'all been here, and I just need y'all to go dance for so. <laughs> hey. We back. So, I'm, y'all know normally I'll be on that nasty shit. Uh, but I'm be good today. Uh-huh. <laughs> today I'm be good. We'll uh-huh. PG-13. Hey. Really just break shit. So, with the thing, we honor Martin Luther King, so this first one is called Dreaming. Hence the shirt. <clears throat> I say to you today, my friends, even though we face the difficulties of today and tomorrow, I still have a dream. It is a dream deeply rooted in the American dream. I have a dream that one day this nation will rise up, live out its true meaning of its creed. We hold these truths to be self-evident that all men are created equal. I wonder what Dr. King would think if he was still alive to see how divided the people he lost his life for choose to be. Back in these days, black people were a united community, breaking bread together like one big family. They prayed together, cried together, suffered together, fought together. Every family knew each other. They looked out for each other and truly cared for one another. Segregation became integration because we stood together, hand in hand, marching together, united for the cause of good for all people. But what happened to the unity? What happened to the community? The African American race would be united, could be more powerful than any army, but yet it chooses to be the most divided ethnicity. Uh-huh. We complain about racist cop killing us, but yet we kill us. Uh-huh. We take our own justice because in our minds, it's just us. Uh-huh. We'd rather cut, each other, cut off each other's legs instead of helping our own get to the next level because we don't want another person to be more successful. Uh-huh. Neighbors are more like perfect strangers living 10 feet away, but they don't even know each other's name. Uh-huh. But what happened to us? When did we, when did we become our own worst enemies? We all want to live in a society where all men are viewed as equal and color doesn't dictate what, how we are treated. But how can, it, how can society... Hold on. You're good. Come on, Come on Chloe. Good. Good. But what happened to us? When did we become our own worst enemies? We all want to live in a society where all men are viewed as equal and color doesn't dictate how we are treated. But how can we expect society to treat us as equals when we tear down our own people? I wonder what Dr. King was saying if he saw his dream was still just a dream. Come on, come on.